In this video, we will continue with analytical geometry and we'll discuss the midpoint between two points. So the midpoint between two coordinates are its x values added together divided by 2 and its y values added together divided by 2. Let's look at an example. Let's say you're given two sets of coordinates for point A and for point B. And you want to find M, the midpoint between A and B. Now, you are able to find the midpoint without plotting these coordinates. But just for illustration, here are the two points represented on the Cartesian plane. So we want to find M, the exact middle between these two points. So what we do to find the midpoint is we add up the x value of A and the x value of B, and that will give us the middle between the x's. And then we add up the y value of A and the y value of B and divide that by 2, and that will give us the center of the y's. So I can say M is the x of A plus the x of B over 2, and the y of A plus the y of B divided by 2. Now if I substitute, it's negative 3 plus 7 divided by 2. And for the y coordinate, it is 4 plus 10 divided by 2. So m, the coordinates of the midpoint between a and b, is 2 and 7. In this example, we are given the coordinates a, m, and b. But notice, m has a y coordinate of p, and b has an x coordinate of t. Then the question is, solve or find p and t if m is the midpoint between a and b. So the x coordinate of m is equal to the x coordinate of a plus the x coordinate of b divided by 2. So now if I substitute, the x coordinate of m is 2, the x coordinate of a is negative 3, and the x coordinate of b is t. And I divide that by 2. To get rid of the fraction, I multiply everywhere by 2, or I can just cross multiply. And then I transpose the negative 3 in order to find t. So t is equal to 7. Similarly, I have the y coordinate of m, which is p, is equal to the y coordinate of a plus the y coordinate of b divided by 2. This is true because m is the midpoint between a and b. So if I substitute, the y of m is equal to p, the y of a is 4, the y of b is 10, divided by 2, that is 14 divided by 2, so p is equal to 7.